So the next tab that I want to discuss is the settings tab. And here you have 3D settings. Um, if you want to make your timeline three-dimensional, um, these are the, below that are the title, start date, end date, intro, and about. All of those same settings that you had on the create a timeline page. You can adjust all of those things here as well. You can adjust your space, your spacing here. Um, I don't really mess with that because it's, it, it doesn't, it's not user friendly the way that that works. Um, the view type I leave as standard as well. Now you can change your background color here, but it won't matter if you've already chosen an image as your background. So changing the background color won't, won't matter if you have an image for your background. Um, the second color is like your highlight color. So all of the blue that you see in the bottom timeline here, around the dates down here, and where it says event here, that's those are all the places that your, your background color is going to show up. So um, you can actually zoom in or zoom out of your timeline. So the view that people get will either be closer or further away. Um, I like to leave mine at um, sort of a, a low zoom so people can get a, a full idea of what is going on on the complete timeline. Um, and again, with everything else in Tiki Toki, it's going to ask you to save or revert, which is save or revert it back to what it was before you made any changes.